to Tuesday's Tips from So Very Easy. My name is Laura, and today let's talk about protecting our clothing when we wear our favorite brooches. Beautiful brooches are really nice to wear on jackets, dresses, and blouses. And some brooches are very heavy, and that heaviness puts bigger holes in your fabric. So you need to decide how heavy a brooch you can have for the garment. Even though this brooch is very small, it's a heavy brooch, so it's going to want to droop. It's not going to stay upright on the body. Also, it's going to put holes in the garment. Because this is such a lightweight fabric, the pin in the back will cause a larger hole, and that hole might remain. Because as you're wearing this and you're walking, you're bouncing it back and forth, and it's just putting a bigger hole right in the blouse. There is a way that you can wear a brooch to help protect the fabric and help the brooch not droop so much. And the key is going to be fabric backings. Now you're not going to want to put a heavier fabric on something so light because you would see right through that. So you can get a piece of netting or tulle and you can just take this and fold it in half, fold it a couple of times until you get the size of the back of that pin. So I know that pin is going to fit on that piece. This is going to go in the back of the shirt. Depending on how lightweight your fabric is will depend on how much you can fold this. If it's very lightweight, you might only be able to get away with folding it a couple of times. The more opaque it is, the less you're going to be able to fold that little piece of netting. So this is going to go behind. Then when you put the brooch on, the brooch is going to be able to go through the fabric and that little back piece. So this little piece of fabric is going to help protect the shirt from all that wear and it helps it stay upright so it's not so droopy. If you have something heavier, you're going to be able to just take some plain muslin or any cotton fabric that you have and put it right behind. That fabric is going to help protect the back side of that collar. Even with a soft weight jersey, you can put the fabric behind and it's going to help protect this fabric from all of that movement as you're walking and wearing that brooch. To prevent that brooch from moving, you need to make sure that you use as much of that little wire on the back as possible. But there is another way to help protect this and stop it from moving. And they're gonna be little backs for earrings. When you buy earrings, a lot of times you'll have this little rubber piece in, and that helps the earrings stay in display. They work great for the brooches. You're going to put your brooch on your garment exactly where you're going to want it, but you're not going to pull out that last point. You're going to leave that point in from behind. Turn it over and put the two jewelry ends right on the end of that post. Just leave them in the center. Turn the garment over and finish putting the brooch on. When you turn the garment over, you're going to be able to take those little back of earrings and pull them to each side. You don't need to go really tight, you just need to slide them to the end. This is going to prevent that brooch from moving back and forth as you walk. This little piece of fabric is going to help protect the garment and no one will know the difference. So those little pieces of fabric and the backs to the earrings are going to be a key player in keeping those brooches nice on your clothing and to protect your clothing from the back of the brooches. Thank you for joining me today on So Very Easy. Feel free to subscribe and as always, come on back. Let's see what we're sewing next time in the sewing room. Bye for now.